Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. <coughs> Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. The birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure there'll be knock. Ring parcels to your door. Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning Pat feels he's a really happy man Pat feels he's a really happy man <laughs> Sure. Thanks, Pat. Hi, Pat. What do you think? <laughs> it's lovely. It's a welcome banner for George. Oh, who's George? <coughs> Hello, special delivery service. Pat Clifton speaking. <coughs> Pat, I've got an unusual one for you today. How soon can you get here? We're on our way. Meow. <coughs> <coughs> We've got a special delivery, Jess. Oh. What's it going to be today? <laughs> ben! Meow. Hi, Pat. What do you think? It's a very nice glass tank with some leaves in it. It's a bit more than that, Pat. Take a closer look. Oh. Wow. What is it? It's a gecko. He's called George. Oh, so this is George. He's all ready for you to deliver to Mira at the cafe. He's her new pet. Great. Come on then, George. Oh no, those crates need delivering to Dorothy. I completely forgot. And PC Selby's coming to inspect all the STS vehicles in a minute. Don't worry, I'll take them on my way. Thanks, Pat. Jess, stop it! Meow. There. All safe and ready to go. Thanks, Pat. Bye! This is going to be George's new home. His bed's going to be there and he's got lots of tree bark and tunnels to explore there. I thought geckos came from hot countries. He's going to get cold in Greendale. That's why Dad's going to get a special light bulb to put in the tank so he can stay nice and warm. Cool, huh? Ugh! I don't think I'd want a gecko. They're all slithery and scary. Charlie, geckos aren't scary. They're cute. Ah, love one. Oh. oh, stop it, Bill. <laughs> oh. Hello, everyone. Here you are, Dorothy. Oh, thanks, Pat. 
they're just what I need for my new lavender honey display. Do you want to taste some? I'd love to, but I'm in the middle of a special delivery for Mira. I'm delivering her a gecko. A gecko? Oh, can I have a peek? I've never seen one before. Well, of course. Ta-da! Oh, there's nothing there. <laughs> Look more closely, Dorothy. Um, no, still nothing. Morning, Pat. What have you got in there? It's a gecko, Reverend. Really? Where? That's what I said. Here, let me show you. Look! He's not there. Ow. George has escaped. Oh! <gasps> Let's have a go, Mira. Oh. Bill! Sorry, Mira. Hello, everyone. Look what I've got. It's the heat bulb. Thanks, Dad. This will keep George really warm. Look. Wow. wow. Perfect. Thanks, Dad. Better turn it off till George gets here. Ooh, I'm late for the 12.05. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Oh, Pat, what are you going to do? Let's look around. He can't have gone far. Ted, can you let me know if you see a gecko anywhere? A gecko? No, oh, by gum. No. 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 It says here, geckos can climb anywhere with their sticky feet and they like to sit in the sun. But, come quick. I found your gecko. Oh. Leave it to me, Ted. I'll get him. Oh, Pat. Come on, George. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh, by heck. Don't fret, Pat. You'll find him. Thanks, Mrs Goggins. I hope so. Oh, I'd better go. The Pancaster Flyer leaves in five minutes. I'll give you a lift to the station. It looked like George was heading in that direction. Oh, thanks, Pat. Hmm. All in order. Ready, Arthur? Ready when you are, Ben. Oi! Stop! Oh! Uh, yes. Thanks, Ben. All in order. Hi, Pat. George has disappeared. Oh, no. Yes, I'll tell Mira you're a bit delayed. Bye, Pat. Who's George? Don't worry, Ben. This is a job for a real detective. I'll have that missing gecko back in no time. Thanks, Arthur. Good luck. <laughs> Hello, PC Selby. Arthur, there's something strange in my pool. Office. Strange, eh? I'm he's all happening today. Don't worry, Mrs. Goggins. I'm on me way. Oh, boy. Help! <laughs> right. What seems to be the problem? Over there. <laughs> Ah! 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 Ah!
all right, Mrs. Goggins. Everything's under control. Aha, gotcha. George, George. Pat speaking. Hmm. I'll be right there. Come on, Jess. He's over there, Pat. Oh, Pat, quickly. Here, George. That's a good gecko. That's it. I'm just going... <coughs> oh, Jess! <coughs> what? OK, thank you. Bye, Pat. Mira? That was Pat on the phone. He says, don't worry, and George is somewhere in Greendale. So he still hasn't found him yet. What are we going to do? Why don't we, why don't we help Pat look for George? Is that okay, Mum? Can we go and help Pat? Of course you can. Hooray! Wicked! See you later. Bye. Okay. Tell me everything you know about geckos. There must be something I haven't thought of yet. They eat at night. Oh, they're a bit scary and slithery. Charlie! What else? Um, they chirp when they talk. And they like to eat insects they find in the grass. Hmm, somewhere grassy where there's insects. I think I know just the place. Right, who can make a chirping sound? Mira? <laughs> hmm, not quite. What about you, Charlie? No, it's like this. See? Easy peasy. Perfect. OK, let's split up. You two stay here and make sure George doesn't escape. Bill, come with me. Cool. Right, give me one of your best chirps. <laughs> Try again. It's not working, Pat. Wait, listen. Come on, this way. There he is! Wow! Hello again, George. Hey, Mira, come and see. George! George, meet Mira. Mira, meet George. Hi, George. You're beautiful. Thanks, Pat. Thanks, Bill. Be careful. It's OK, Charlie. See? Oh, he likes you. <laughs> He's tickling. He's not scary at all. Wow. <laughs> I think George has got a party to go to. Come on, George. Let's go home. Well, Let's go. Cool. Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Special delivery service. Pat is on his way. Special delivery service. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Postman Pat and his black and white cat <coughs> Early in the morning Just as day is dawning He picks up all the post bags in his van Postman Pat, Postman Pat Postman Pat and his black and white cat <coughs> All 
the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure they'll be knock. Ring parcels to your door. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. <laughs> Hello, Pat. Morning, Aunt Jay. Whew. What this got you? Meow. So, all set for the Greendale show? Yes, it's going to be the best show ever. We've got Alf's sheep. Help, Pat. I'm pumpkin doing some show jumping. Hi, Pat. Mm -hmm. There's kite making and paddling pool. Morning, Pat. Michael's famous homemade ice cream. Hello, Pat. And Ted's bringing his latest invention. He says it's amazing. Ooh. Oh. Excuse me. Hello, special delivery service. Pat Clifton speaking. Pat, it's Ben. I've got an urgent delivery. How soon can you get here? We're on our way. Oh, and Pat, you might want to bring an umbrella. Hey, An umbrella? Doesn't look like rain. <coughs> See you later, Ajay. Bye, Pat. We've got a special delivery, Jess. Wow. What's it going to be today? Ben. Hello, Ted. Shouldn't you be at the Greendale show? Me truck's gone and broken down. I need you to deliver me new invention. The Ted Glenn Amazing Weather Machine. Wow! Allow me to demonstrate. If I want it to rain, I just say, rain. Rain. Bingo! It is now raining. Ooh. If I want some wind, I just say wind. Wind. Yes! Very impressive, Ted! Ooh. And if I want it to snow, I just say snow. Snow. Is it real? No, it's instant snow. Ice cold and guaranteed never to melt. What do you reckon? I reckon we ought to get going, Ted, if we want to get to the show on time. Do you need a lift to Greendale, Ted? No thanks, Pat. I've got to fix me truck first. I'll see you at the show. OK, see you there. to the Greendale show. And remember, if it gets too hot, then why not treat yourself to one of Michael's delicious homemade ice creams? Yum! There you go. One raspberry ripple. Oh. Oh, no. My ice cream's melting. It's too hot. Oh, oh no. no. Still, not to worry. There's plenty more to see and do. And remember, any time now, Ted Glenn will be here with his new invention. Wait, please! Oh, come on, Ted. You should be here by now. Morning, Dr. Gilbert 
Watson. Morning, Pat. What a day. Mind you, I should think those flowers there could probably do with a spot of rain. Rain. Oh! oh. Ted's weather machine. What's going on? I don't know how to switch it off. Ooh. <laughs> oh, at last. Sorry, everyone. It's Ted's amazing weather machine. It does whatever you tell it to. Oh, yes. So, if I say win, it will win. Whoa, hell! Whoa! Uh, oh. Boy, stop! Stop that, Ted! Arthur, you've got the wind. Oh. There. That machine is a public nuisance. I have a good mind to place it under arrest. But this is my special delivery. I need to get it to the Greendale show. All right. On you go, Pat. But try and keep that thing under control. I will. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, Pat. Good luck. <sighs> oh. Oh. <sighs> so, still to come, Ted's amazing invention. But first, let us see some show jumping from Amy and Pumpkin. Come on, boy, you can do it. <sighs> Dear, he's too hot. I'm sorry, Ajay. Oh. Don't worry, there's still lots to do. There's the paddling pool. Sorry, Ajay. Our sheep were getting thirsty. That's okay. Not to worry. How's our kite makers getting on? Oh, wow! Look at that amazing kite! Three, two, one, lift off! Oh! Oh! There's no wind. This weather's no good. It's too hot. I want to go home. Me too! <laughs> No, wait. There's lot to see and do. There's a. Oh. <sighs> Dad, you're here. But where's your new invention? You mean Pat hasn't delivered it yet? Mrs. Goggins. Good morning, Pat. What a lovely day. I've just been up to see my sister. Oh, you should have seen the weather. Snow, 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 and more snow. Oh, snow. She said it was the worst she'd known it for years. Oh. And that wasn't the half of it. Really? Phew. Gosh. Rain, high winds, hailstones. <laughs> Rain. High winds, hailstones. Oh no, Mrs. Goggins, stop! Don't panic, Mrs. Goggins. Uh, there. Right. Best be going. I need to get this to the Greendale... <coughs> eh? Oh, no! Oh. oh. Pat Clifton speaking. Pat, it's Ben. What's going on? There's a problem. We've got... Snow. On the road. Snow? But how? Ted's weather machine. But you need to get to the Greendale show. 
I know. Don't worry. We'll find a way. Hmm. By heck. But What's been going on? We'll never get to the show in time with all this snow on the road. Yes, we will. We just need to clear it away. A special delivery always gets through. Come on, I've got a spade in my van. And I've got some buckets in my truck. We'll help, won't we, Bonnie? Thanks, Mrs Goggins. Let's get to work. <laughs> Thanks for your help, Mrs Goggins. Oh, you're welcome. Bye, Ted. Bye, Pat. Cheer up, Adjay. Have a nice cup of tea. No, thanks, Dorothy. It's a bit too hot for tea. The whole day's been a complete disaster. The ice creams have melted, there's no wind for the kites, and the sheep have drunk the peddling full dry. Hello, Ajay. Sorry I'm late. We had a spot of bother with the weather. No worries. Hello, hello, everyone. Thank you for waiting so, um, patiently. It's my very great pleasure to introduce the Ted Glenn Amazing Weather Machine. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Take it away, Ted. Right you are. Rain. Rain. Oh, fantastic! The animal's drinks. The paddling pool. Wind. Wind. this to keep my ice creams cool. Hooray! Go pumpkin! Pat, you've saved the day. Thank you. It's the best Greendale show ever. It's Ted's machine. And if he hadn't helped me clear all that snow away... Snow. Sorry, Jess. Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Special delivery service. Pat is on his way. Special delivery service. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. <coughs> Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be. 
be sure there'll be knock ring parcels to your door postman pat postman pat postman pat and his black and white cat all the birds are singing and the day is just beginning pat feels he's a really happy man pat feels he's a really <laughs> That's the last of the post bags, Mrs. Goggins. And this postcard is for you. Oh, thank you, Pat. Oh, it's from my sister up in the Highlands. Oh, she says she's sending me a present to remind me of Bonnie Scotland. Do you miss Scotland, Mrs. Goggins? Ah, sometimes. It's been a long, long time since I was back. Oh, excuse me, Mrs. Goggins. Special delivery service. Pat Clifton speaking. <coughs> Hello? Pat, can you get here right away? We've got a oh, very special delivery. I'll be there as soon as I can. Bye, Ben. Bye, Pat. <gasps> oh. We've got a special delivery, Jess. <coughs> What's it going to be today? Meow. Bye, Mrs. Goggins. Bye, Pat. Hmm. That noise sounded so familiar. Meow. Ben. Ben. That! It's a set of bagpipes for Mrs. Goggins. See? Oh, right. I think I'm getting the hang of it now. It's all in the fingering. Really? Well, I'd better get them to Mrs. Goggins. OK, Pat. Oh, pardon me. Uh, bye, Ben. Come on, Jess. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Oof! No! Hide and seek's boring! Why don't we play Grandma's Footsteps? That's no good. Bill always cheats. I do not. Do? <sighs> oh. Oh, where are they? Must be somewhere. Hi, Ted. Is everything all right? No. I've lost the keys to me workshop. I put them on the Ted Glenn Sound and Found keyring, and now they've disappeared. Sound and Found keyring? Aye. It's me latest invention. All you have to do is make a loud sound, and the keyring beeps, and that tells you where your keys are. Listen. Oh, maybe I'm just not loud enough. Oh dear. I wish I could stay and help, but I'm on a special delivery. It's me keys. Them pipes have done the trick. Thanks, Pat. You're welcome, Ted. Bye. <laughs> it's green, it's little, and there's lots of it! Guess what? Grass. Ooh, yes. Oh. Let's play something else. Like what? I don't know. Oh. Stop it! Go away! Oh. oh, I say, that's a bit much.
much. Shoo, shoo! What you doing, you naughty things? Hello, love. What's going on? Oh, Pat, it's been like this all morning. The birds keep trying to steal bits of food and nothing scares them away. I said shoo! And I meant it! Yes, I see what you mean. Shoo, shoo! Hello, Pat. Ah! Stop it! It's no good. We might as well just pack up early. Shoo! I wish I could help, but I've got to get this special delivery to Mrs Goggins. It's OK, love. You get on. See you later. the birds away. Have I? Oh, Pat, you are clever. However <gasps> did you do it? It wasn't me. It was my special delivery. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I say, Pat. Your tyre, it's gone down. Oh, no. Come on, Jess. We'll have to go back to the sorting office and get the van. Bye, everyone. <laughs> bye, bye, bye Pat. It's getting late, Pat. Don't worry, Ben. We'll have these bagpipes with Mrs Goggins soon. Won't we, Jess? Meow. Daisy! Millie! Flora! Get on with ya! What on earth? Alf, what's going on? Hey up, Pat. It's me cows. They just won't budge. But I've got to get these special delivery bagpipes to Mrs Goggins. And I'm late already. Well, I'm sorry, Pat. I don't know what to do. Nothing's shifting them. <coughs> These are Highland cattle, aren't they? That's right. And the Highlands are in Scotland, aren't they? So? So, I might know how to move them. Bagpipes? I don't understand. Bagpipes are from Scotland too, just like the cows. They seem to like the sound of them, so I thought maybe if I play them, the cows might follow me. Well, it's worth a try. I'd never have believed that. You're a regular Pied Piper, Pat. Thanks, Alf. Oh, I'd better be going. Bye. Bye, Pat. I don't want to play Duck Duck Goose. We always play that. All right, then. What do you want to play? Yes, go on, Bill. Yeah. Well, uh... uh... Hello, everyone. What are you playing? Nothing. Oh. We can't find anything we all want to play. Hmm. Have you ever heard of noisy hide-and-seek? Noisy hide-and-seek? How do you play that? Oh, it's easy. I used to play it when I was a wee lass. One person is the seeker and they wear a blindfold and everyone else has to make a special noise. Like this? <laughs> yes, just like that. 
The seeker has to find them by following the noise. Brilliant! And everyone has to make a different noise. How about this? Perfect! Will you show us how to play it, Mrs. Goggins? Oh, yes! yes. Well, <laughs> it's been so long. <sighs> I'd love to. <laughs> Hello, Ajay. What's up? Hello, Pat. I can't open the door on the mail van. And I'm meant to be picking up the call for Pancaster. See? Oh, let me help you. Oh, but it's a... Uh... It's no good, Ajay. Oh, it's stuck. That's what I'm trying to say. It's a special new door. It's only supposed to open when the flyer whistle blows. See? I don't think it's loud enough. Hmm, not loud enough. Hang on a minute, Ajay. Bagpipes? How's that going to help? Watch this. <laughs> You did it! Thank you! No problem. Come on, Jess. Let's get this special delivery back on track. <sighs> Beep. Beep. Ooh. Oh, where are you? Nee da dee da dee da. <whistles> oh, I can hear you. <whistles> Goodness me, Sarah. <whistles> Hello. What's that? That's a very familiar sound. Oh. Mrs. Goggins, here's your special delivery. Bad pipes. Oh, they must be from my sister. Oh, what a day. Noisy hide and seek and bagpipes. Can you play them, Mrs. Goggins? Well, I've not played for years. But they do say you never forget how to play the pipes. Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Special delivery service. Pat is on his way. Special delivery service. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure there'll be knock. Ring parcels to your door. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. The birds are singing And the day is just beginning Pat feels he's a really happy man Pat 
feels he's a really happy man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Mum. Bye, love. Meow. Meow. I know you've enjoyed having Dotty for the weekend, Jess, but she's got to go back to the school now. Meow. Calm down, Jess. You'll see Dotty again soon. Bye, Dad. Bye. <laughs> Not now, Jess. I'm driving. Hello, special delivery service. Pat Clifton speaking. Pat, I've got an unusual one for you today. How soon can you get here? We're on our way. We've got a special delivery, Jess. Meow. What's it going to be today? <laughs> ben? <laughs> Hi, Pat. Here's your special delivery. It's for Lauren at the school. What is it? A musical telescope? No, it's a didgeridoo. A didgeridoo what? A didgeridoo. It's a special musical instrument all the way from Australia. Oh, here, give it a blow. <gasps> hmm. I don't think the didgeridoo is quite your instrument, Pat. No, maybe I'd best leave it to the children. Come on, Jess. Oh, these need to go to Pencaster Station too, Pat. No problem. I'll drop them off on the way. Hmm. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> OK, everyone. Shh. We're going to be exploring musical instruments from different countries. Like this gong from China. Cool! Let's rock! <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank you, Bill. You're all going to have a chance to play them. Some are very tricky to learn, especially my surprise instrument. <gasps> right. Let's get started. <laughs> Jess, would you please sit still? Dottie's gone. <laughs> hmm, we're nearly on empty. I think we'd better fill up before we go any further. A didgeridoo what's it? <laughs> a didgeridoo. Uh, it's from Australia. Give it a blow. <gasps> <laughs> Jess, be quiet. It wasn't that bad. <laughs> Here, let me have another go. <gasps> all right, all right, Jess. Maybe I do need more practice. Oop. Hello? 
Hi, Pat. Is everything OK? Why have you stopped at the garage? Everything's fine, Ben. We just had to fill up. What's that noise? Uh, nothing. We're on our way. <laughs> Ted? Sorry. <laughs> well done, everyone. Ooh, I wonder where Pat Mrs. is. Mrs Taylor! Mrs Taylor! Dottie's not in her cage! <gasps> She's gone. Oh, poor Dotty. Oh no! Oh, we need to oh, what's happened to Dotty? Oh, where could she? Where is she? Don't worry, everyone. She can't have gone far. Let's all look for her. It's Dottie. here, Dotty. Dotty, where are you? Hey, is that one of them didgeridoos? Yes, it is, Ajay. Oh. Have you played one before? No. But my great-uncle Kule was a daband. Can I have a go? Well, I... Thanks, man. <gasps> ah, yes. Well, it takes years of practice to play as well as my great-uncle Kule. <laughs> Not bad, eh? Not bad at all, Pat. Yeah. Right, off to the school then, Jess. Bye, Ajay. Ta da, Pat. Oh. oh! Hello, Mrs. Goggins. Is everything okay? I... Oh, Pat, I know you're on a special delivery, but Dorothy left her shopping in the post office earlier, and I was wondering if you could drop it at Thompson Ground on your way. Of course I can. Thank you, Pat. There's nothing tasty in there for you, Jess. Come away. Bye, Pat. Bye, Mrs. Goggins. Dotty, where are you? Dotty, come on, Dotty. Is everything okay, Lauren? No. Dotty's missing. The cage door was open and she must have got out. Oh, dear. She was definitely in the cage when Pat left this morning. I'll give him a call. Maybe he can help. Delivery for you, Alf. That's grand, Pat. Meow. Jess. Oh, dear. Now look what you've done. Meow. <laughs> oh, no. It's rolled into me log pile. They all look the same, Alf. How am I going to find the didgeridoo? Oh, well, we'll have to look through them all. Oh. <coughs> Special delivery service. Pat Clifton speaking. Pat, it's Lauren. Dottie's escaped. Have you seen her? Oh dear, no, I haven't. I'm busy with the special delivery at the minute, but I'll help look for her as soon as I can. Thanks, Pat. Bye. Dottie's gone missing. Oh, I. Don't worry, Jess, she won't have gone far. <laughs> Rosie! <laughs> I've never heard her make that noise before. That wasn't Rosie. That was my special delivery. She must have accidentally blown into it. Clever girl, Rosie. <laughs> what does this digitally thingamajig do then? I'll show you. 
Yourself. Oh, that sounded good, Pat. And thanks for bringing me shopping back. No problem, Dorothy. Um, I don't suppose you could take these leftover lettuces to the school, could you? For Dotty? Of course I will. Come on, Jess. What if Dotty never comes back, miss? I really miss her. Hello, Lauren. Here's your special delivery. Thanks, Pat. Hopefully it'll cheer the children up a bit. Look, children, our special instrument has arrived. This has come all the way from Australia. It's called a didgeridoo. Cool. cool. Wow. Can we play it, miss? I bet I can. Of course you can. It must be broken. Oh, no. It isn't broken, Bill. Watch. <laughs> Look, that box is moving. See? I told you we'd find us somewhere nearby. <laughs> I don't think she'll be hungry for a while, though. This was full of lettuces when I left Thompson Ground. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, then, everyone. Let's play some instruments. Hooray! If you would, please, Pat. It'd be my pleasure, Lauren. <gasps> Delivery service. Mission accomplished. Special delivery. 